Sometimes you may need to download many applications at once as a batch and you would like to do it from the trusted source. One of the best ways to do it in Windows 10 is using Ninite.com. To do that, let's launch the browser and you can navigate to Ninite.com. And here on the site, you see a list of free or open source applications and uh, you can select which ones you would like to download. Once you select what you want, the packages them and allows uh, you to download and install them all at once. And it also sets them up for automatic updates. This is basically a way of packaging applications to quickly download them from the trusted source, which is very important. And uh, also set them up so you can continuously get updates uh, when updates come out. I typically select browsers here because I like to use Chrome browser and Firefox, uh, select the free compression utility, uh, which is very helpful for uh, Windows 7-zip. I select VLC Media Player, uh, which has a lot more capabilities than built-in uh, Windows Player, and uh, typically select Notepad++. Your interests might be different, so definitely explore those tools and see what's available. But let's go through the step and download. To proceed, what you want to do is uh, select everything that you need and then click Get Your Knee Night. Ninite packages the applications and uh, creates the executable, which you can trust because this is a reputable source and a lot of people use this. Um, you click Run on this executable. Windows prompts you, do you really want to trust Ninite? And uh, you click Yes here. And after that, it goes and installs all these applications that you have selected. Once installation is complete, you can click Close. All applications are installed. You see VLC Media Player, Notepad++, and both browsers. Now what you can do, you can uh, position them for effective launch. You can launch them from here, from Start Menu. Or if you launch it once, you can pin it by doing right mouse click and then selecting Pin to Taskbar option. Now even if you close Chrome browser, the icon is still there and you can quickly relaunch it again. If you'd like the content, please make sure to click the like button, share with your friends, and subscribe to my channel. A lot of times, you may need additional applications to supplement your Windows 10 installation. To find and install them, you need to navigate to Microsoft Store, which is available right from your Start menu. To do that, let's type Microsoft Store in the Start menu. It launches Microsoft Store. And typically what I'm looking for is productivity apps, but your interests might be different. For example, if you click on the Office 365, it offers you to download or sign up for a, a subscription, pay either uh, by annually or pay uh, monthly. And as part of this subscription, you will get access to Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneDrive, Outlook, and Publisher and Access. One of the best and coolest features of Microsoft Store is the ability to shop in one place and find what you're looking for. For example, if we go to home, you can navigate through different categories like gaming, entertainment, productivity, and search for deals. It used to be that you have to go online and find applications for Windows platform from a lot of different publishers, but now Microsoft Store centralizes it. Another cool thing about Store is Microsoft vetting a lot of applications before they publish them in the store, which means that they protect you against potential vulnerabilities as a lot of hackers try to pose as the valid uh, application providers making you download apps and then uh, make your system vulnerable so they can access and steal information. So getting it from Microsoft Store a lot of times is a way of protecting yourself against that. What are the other features of Windows 10 you use on a daily basis? Can you please post them in the comments of this video so we all can learn? Thank you very much. If this video was helpful, make sure to click the like button in your browser. Also, please help your friends to learn this topic faster by sharing this video with them. And if you would like to be the first one to know about new videos to help you reach your goals faster, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to check out my other relevant videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We have a lot of great stuff planned in the pipeline and I don't want you to miss any of it. And if you'd like to get notified about all the new stuff that are coming out, make sure to subscribe to my email list as well. All links are here on the screen. Make sure to click to stay in touch. Thanks again for watching.